So today I've been using Multitrack Studio on uh, the uh, Toshiba here, 23 inch touchscreen. Uh, because I need full uh, power there, you know, I need to be able to like chain dozens of effects together. Um, lots of CPU. So I'm inputting my music in through the Sonus I2M here. This is a high impedance audio interface to USB. And then it also converts the uh, audio signal into a MIDI notation there. So I have multiple channels of MIDI tracks coming at the same time I'm recording audio. And then I can assign any kind of instruments to those, to virtual instruments, in order to make it sound completely different from a concertina. So today, for example, I wanted something that sounds like a military track, you know, something military that I might put in like a flash game. And so I did a few notes on concertina and assigned an instrument to, I discarded the audio track and then assigned a few instruments and settings into this. So I'm using DSK brass with a preset uh, for, you know, to get some big instruments down there. Um, we're putting that on a loop there, so those few notes that I put in there uh, repeat over and over and over. And then finally, uh, my all my pedals here for, you know, obviously I can't put my foot down and stomp on these, but I can turn on or turn off overdrive, reverb, delay, phaser, flanger. So the standard uh, effects that you might have with guitar, you know, but for concertina. Or whatever else I put in front of it. Uh, so down here I have a uh, drum track, standard standard drum kit, and I tapped in a few things. And again, I have a looper in place here, so it's recording what I those notes and then repeating them uh, for whatever many measures I set it up. Um, So, so this is how it sounds like something you might have in the middle of, you know, you're in a mission, you know, your enemies are coming out from all over the place here. This is the mood I'm going for. So something very brass, bit urgent and... Uh, so that's my current method of you know making odd music. So it differs from what I play out in the street. When I'm out in the street, I'm just playing concertina. I'm not carrying all this around there. So and a lot of my videos, or a lot of my videos, are more about just playing concertina. They don't have all the effects and things like that. So. So it sounds more like that, and that's got its own place. It's a separate place uh, for where I am. And it probably depends on if I'm in the street, if I'm, you know, hanging out on a seawall playing something. I'm going to sound very traditional. If I'm online, it's all this, and then there's in between there, and I'm trying to mer get these worlds all together come together so we'll see if the technology helps me facilitate it that um, also I just need to spend more time learning to become a better player so it's practice 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 but again when I'm doing that I'm just hearing you know this traditional and so balancing that with what I have in my mind for being able to visualize entirely different things here. That's, that's a long step ahead there. That's very hard work. 